So if you didn't know, I've been searching and searching and searching to complete the base set of Pokemon and it's been a real, real big hassle. I've been out on this journey for about over a little over a year now trying to find all the cards to complete base set to find cards at least decent enough to be in the binder. They don't have to be perfect. They don't have to be PSA 10s, 9s. They could be PSA 5s. As long as they look decent in the binder, I'm going to get it. But first, let's open up some random booster packs. I got some random booster packs that I just picked out randomly. Um, so I want to just kind of just warm up, not warm up, but just kind of open these up first and then we'll get into my binder and then what cards I actually found. So, you know what, let's, let's save Vivid Voltage for last. Let's get into some base set of the Scarlet and Violet. Still at the time of this very new set, you could get this in stores now. I decided to just open up a random pack that I have here and let's see if we can get anything to complete, uh, go towards completing our binder. And cycles are hard, nothing there. And Silver Tempest, Silver Tempest, I'm not really, if we get some good cards, it goes into like a little small binder. I'm not trying to get the master set of this. There's only a very few cards I tried to do that with. But here we are, let's see what we get. But anyway, I've been trying to, uh, complete this base set for some time. Um, trying to get ooh Malamar into a Crobat. Nice. I'm trying to complete this set, uh, base set anyway. And it's been, it's been kind of tough. What is this? Oh, City and Flame. You know, it's it's been tough. Uh, this it, it's been tough not finding the cards. I think it's been more tough of like the price of what people are selling you know the cards for uh, ridiculous amount for even cards that are like beat up and it's like I, I really feel like oh let's go Glamora EX I don't know if we have that card yet but I guess I feel like they're really just trying to get like that person who doesn't really know about Pokemon cards maybe a young kid or a parent who doesn't know who's trying to buy for the kid and they're trying to like really overcharge on some of these cars that are crazy, crazy beat up. But, um, oh, not a good cold card, no. But I went to a little uh, collecticon type of thing and I actually found a few cars that I needed for a decent, decent price. So I really can't complain. Um, really can't complain of how much I spent. Okay, I'm going to try my best to get this binder on here. But this is uh, my base set binder. Uh, I use card guard because I, I kind of like how they look. You can use, of course, whatever binder you like. But this is uh, my base set binder. And let me hit in my camera as I did. Um, I have, you know, you know, probably best. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Probably better for me to go this angle. Um, to show you guys but you can see can i even get closer oh, oh i can you guys can see here um i have quite a bit of um cards um that i am missing um but i have majority of them and a lot of these cards even the commons and uncommons are not too bad um just quality wise um maybe a little bit of like you know nicks at the top but i even put in like these little sticky notes um no they're not stuck to the binder that um shows the cards that i am missing yes i am even collecting the energies so i'm going to take out a card to kind of just show you a little bit of the quality of the ones i'm looking for if i could find it these cards are are they're still out there but it's still really hard to try to get them um, as in like, you know, with a decent price because people are like really marking these things up. Um, as you can see, the Gyarados has, I think it has like a little bit of a, some scratches, like right in, I think those are factory scratches if my camera will focus in, but like, it's not like too bad, you know, all the way around you see at the bottom there's a little bit but for the binder um it's really not that bad 
Uh, for the binder, I got something in there that I probably gotta get out. But as you can see, I am missing a few cards and I got a few cards right here. And I wanna flip these over. Now, the qualities of the the quality of these cards aren't great at all. They 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 suck. Um to 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 put it nicely. Uh and I did get them for uh pretty cheap. You can even tell, look at look at the bottom of this card already. It's it, they suck. So the first card we have here is oh we're going right into it venusaur this venusaur is um it has seen better days but i got it for a really great price um and like i said this is for the binder and then maybe later on in life if um i find one that's a little bit better that i want to put into the binder i will but if i do find a venusaur that's basic that's better i'm probably going to try to get it graded uh i i, I will take anything that's like a seven plus you can kind of see, uh, I know my light is super bright, I have a ring light over on this side, but there's like white little specks um, on here. The the hollow is, is really bad. I don't know if you guys can see like right there, there's uh, the hollow is just bleeding through. The back of it looks like crap. Look at the bottom. I got this card for a whopping 20, 25 bucks. And I might have overpaid. The guy wanted forty dollars for this. Forty dollars. This will come back probably at PSA two, if it can even get that. There is so much. The centering on it is bad. Um, the centering on the back is probably a little bit better. But look at the bottom. It's just destroyed. He had this. I think he had this card up for like forty or fifty bucks. And um, um. He was like, you know, it is messed up, blah, blah, blah. I, I'll do it for 25. I said, you know what? I'll take 25 for that card because it's, it's going in the binder. We have this bad boy, Zapdos base set. Um, really, this card is in the same boat as you can see. Look at the bottom of it. Very bad chipped. You know, this is heavily played. Uh, it's, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty bad. This scratches on it. It's, it's not great. $10. $10 for this card. I, I did it because, like I said, it's supposed to be for the binder. Um, and it, it was perf it's perfect enough just to be in there for now. Um, next card that we have is uh, Magneton, which honestly is not as bad as the other two. These other two are a lot worse. Um, the back of it... As you can see, it's not bad neither. A little bit of whiting at the top in the corners. Um, not too crazy. And then I probably really can't focus in too much. But the hollow foil has one scratch. It's like one, oops, one scratch going down right there. Not bad, but we did need um that card as well i was trying to get like anything that'd be like a seven or more for the binder um oh sorry this is not even part of it somebody gave me this card this is ash's pikachu i never got one of these cards or if i did i don't remember getting it but somebody threw that in there for me so we'll keep uh pikachu up there next caterpie yes i needed a caterpie not bad caterpie a little bit of whiting on the top but i definitely needed uh this caterpie I needed a dugong gong gong gong. Nice little dugong, not bad at the bottom. Once again, I, not too bad. Great for the binder. I did need the leaf energy. Um, I just want to be able to open up my binder and be like, wow, like the old arts of these cards. This Electabuzz is terrible. Oh, it's bent. You can probably see it up there. It, this thing is just kaboom completely destroyed all the way around it's not even worth to be in the binder but i need it the last card we have here is a first edition of a champ um but um you get you usually get this card if i'm not mistaken out of the the theme the theme deck the starter theme deck um you would get this card not bad i can't remember how much i paid for this because the back of it even if i lay it down there's a little bit of whiting up there it's not too crazy not too bad but i needed it for the binder 
Uh, so I was really excited about that. I did get this for a decent price because I think I bought that card amongst other cards with it. So the guy was like, oh, I'll give you a little deal. Blah, blah, blah. But anyway, we needed this Magneton. So we're going to throw Magneton in here like so. Perfect. Next, we need Machamp. So... paper perfect next i'm going to pull it to the side here so i won't hit the camera so bear with me we're going to have to do zapdos and venusaur they're both here here goes zapdos venusaur i'm putting mine in the actual number order um so which is pretty cool i do have charizard charizard though the charizard i have is um, in a top loader sleeve. I'm not sure if I'm adding it to this binder or not. Uh, here goes Venusaur, um, because I kind of want to get it graded, but at the same time, um, I don't think it's worth it. Uh, somebody actually had a Charizard. It was like 250 bucks, and it was like a, I don't know, like a PSA 4. <laughs> it, it, it was crazy, um, and I, I couldn't get much service to really like check the value of what PSA 4 up here is Electabuzz is up here. You guys can't see it, but I am entering it in. We have Caterpie, which is right here. Caterpie, we needed that. Let's add Caterpie to this. Caterpie, and then Dugong. I think Dugong was back here, right? Dugong was back here. Here we go. And then, last but not least, we're gonna flip a few and then we're going to put the grass energy that I needed. Last energy. No, I need one more. I need the double colors. But oh, we got the grass energy there. So if you guys did enjoy uh, that, um, please let me know down below. Uh, maybe even let me know if you're missing some cards from your set that you're trying to complete. I'm going to be, after we complete base set, actually, we're pretty close to completing base set. I think I'm gonna start working on um, jungle. Um, as well as fossil i want to have those base set not first edition uh it's really tough to get first edition cards maybe one day we'll be able to do that i might have to order like those cards kind of off the line and hope for the best but either way um completing uh base set is one of my goals uh completing jungle and fossil also one of my other goals uh so we'll be doing uh that and i'll be taking you guys on the journey with me so once again if you did enjoy if you did like please leave uh, a like on the video, comment down below, subscribe if you're not yet, subscribe the time of this video. Um, I think we're over 700 subscribers, uh, so I don't know where we stand once this video go gets posted on Wednesday. But um, thank you so much for the support, and then uh, also just put the notification on so you know when I do go live. Other than that, I'm going to head out of here. I want to thank you again for watching. Don't forget to smile, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!